just got back from the orchard, got me some Washington Red Delicious apples. If you don't go out to the orchard this time of the year, you are totally missing out. There are so many orchards in and around mid-Michigan, from Spicers to Baines to Porters. It's a great time. It's wonderful to sit there and drink the fresh apple cider. Well, I'm gonna show you how to make the easiest caramel apples you've ever made. The kids are gonna love them, and they're probably the most delicious you're ever gonna try. We're gonna use my caramel apple all-natural dip mix. We're gonna mix that up right now because that's going to act as our caramel. Take the packet, cut it open, which I've done. We're just gonna pour this into the mixer. Then we're gonna take eight ounces of softened cream cheese. Let this sit out for a while, or you can put it in the microwave to get rid of some of the hot spots just for about 30 or 20 seconds. Turn this mixer on. Let this mix up. I always like lift it up a little bit every now and then just to make sure it's not all stuck in the whisk. While that's mixing up, you're gonna take some peanut, chop them up into fine pieces like this. You can use a chopper, you can do it by hand, you can smash them in a bag, whatever is the easiest way for you. Then you're gonna take some bamboo sticks. You can get them in the grilling section at the store. You might wanna cut them to make them a little smaller. As you can see, they're pretty tall. We've cut this one. You're gonna take that, just put that right in to your apple. So you have your apple now, which is on the bamboo stick. Let's check out this caramel here to make sure it's mixing up. And I think it is about done. Yes, it is. I'm gonna take this off of the mixer. I'm just gonna push down the sides of it and make sure it's nice and mixed up. So we get a nice creamy caramel color. All right. That's that simple. Now you're gonna take your apple on a stick and just dip it in here. Get it nice and coated. Take your chopped peanuts, put them out on a plate. Let me get rid of this out of the way here. Put it on a plate. So that way if you have kids, you can give them each an individual plate with the chopped peanuts. Just stick it in there. There you go. You have your caramel apple covered in caramel with your peanuts. And that way, if you have your own plate, you can take a bite, put more caramel on it, dip it in. I'm going to take a bite of this because this is a fresh apple from the orchard. It is freshly made caramel mix. So bear with me because it's probably going to be a little messy. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Mm. So good. So like going to the fair and getting a caramel apple, going to the orchard, fresh caramel apple, so good. So good, I really want to take another bite, but I don't know if I have time to do that. If you make this, it's a great thing to do with the kids. It's so easy. Just use this all natural caramel apple dip mix that you can find on boygourmet.com. Just takes eight ounces of cream cheese, chop up your peanuts, get your apples from the orchard. And again, if you haven't been to the orchard this year, go. It's a great time. You're gonna love it.